In this video, we'll be talking about colors, how to pick a color, what color combinations go well together, how to choose from our pre-selected color combinations in our template files, background images versus background colors, as well as some general rules that you should know about color. So now that we've picked our template and sorted out sizes, the next thing to talk about is color. But before we talk about colors in general, I want to show you how to select between different preset color combinations in our free templates. It's actually pretty easy to do. Just open your PowerPoint template, click the Design tab at the top of the screen, then click the Colors tab. You'll see a list of all the color options for your template. You can hover your mouse over each one to preview how it looks on the theme itself. When you find a color combination you like, simply click it and the template will automatically update with that color scheme. Now let's talk about colors in general. Most of the time when you use a template, the colors will already be chosen for you. But there may be some times when you want to pick your own for whatever reason. Try to follow these simple rules. Don't use lots of different colors on your posters. Stick with two or three, otherwise things can look confusing. Don't use loud colors that clash. Don't use background images if possible. Stick with colors unless the background image you plan to use is very subtle and muted. See how bad that looks? Not only does it look terrible, it's nearly impossible to read. Here's the same poster without the background image. Isn't that better? It's a lot simpler and you can certainly read it. As far as text color is concerned, be consistent throughout your poster. If you use a specific color for your poster's title text, use the same color for your subheadings. White text on a dark background is tough to read and it tires the eyes. Here's the same poster with dark text on a lighter background. The difference is night and day. Most templates will have the color selected for you, but if you want to use your own, you might want to use a color wheel to help you select which colors go well together. ColorSchemeDesigner.com is pretty simple. You can choose a color and then look at the other side of the color wheel. If you're interested in blue, click somewhere in the blue section of the wheel and up pops a selection of blue colors that go together on the square panel on the right side of the screen. That's all for this video. Find more at MakeSigns.com.